Good evening, good morning, good afternoon. Hello, how's it going? Hello, it's been a while. Been precisely eight days as I last live streamed. But finally, I return. I return back to the world of showing myself off on the internet. Great stuff, right. A new week, it is Monday. And we all know what Monday means. Thank you, Benjamin. Change my tag to R4M because I heard it. All the fastest drivers were switching over to it. Stay awesome, GT. All the best drivers in the world are R4M, mate. I've signed them all up. R4M Lewis Hamilton. R4M Alonso. R4M Schumacher. You name it. They were all part of R4M back in the day. Thank you as always, Benjamin. Good to see you. Good to see everyone. Let's have a quick look at the races this week. Um, I am expecting a lot of carnage, hence the title Embracing the Chaos. Um, race A, the go-kart returns. No donation sound. Okay, it should be on now. Apologize for that. Um, race A, the go-kart, the shifter, Sukuba, 
five laps. That's going to be a bit of chaos. That's, well, a bit of chaos, complete chaos is what I actually mean. Um, R4M Torpedo, yeah, Daniel Gavia, he's he's very highly ranked within the R4M uh, organization. Race B, Group 4 at Willow Springs. We know that this track can spring a rather big surprise sometimes. And, you know, you go off the track and you're never returning, basically. So that one, fairly chaotic race. And then Race C, 11, lap, 11 laps around Maggior in Group 1. So a fair range of races here. We're going to kick off, as always, with race B, as that is in less than 10 minutes time. We're going to do all three, though. Normally, I avoid race A, but it's in a go-kart. It's in the go-kart. For, for those who would have seen my uh, Instagram or Twitter, you would have seen my post. Because over the weekend... I was uh, I was car racing, and it was a real rain fest, as you can see. Absolute treacherous conditions. This one on Saturday. Sunday was a bit better, dried out half of it, half of it the day. In fact, it was very similar to the German Grand Prix. Um, it was like changing weather all day. It was raining, then it was stopped raining, and then it was wet, then it was dry, then it was wet, then it was dry. So. It was a bit strange watching that Grand Prix and then racing at the same time when the weather was actually very similar. Um, yeah, the go-kart. The go-kart. I have no excuses. I should be the master of that race, at least. Oh, I just forgot. I need to add my pedal cam. There we go. So today I'm wearing the checkered flag socks. I don't even quite see those. The light is too strong. You can quite see it. I'm getting some new heel tread socks soon. So if you do wanna and if you do wanna have a look at these heel tread socks, go just Google heel tread, job done. They make a really cool sock actually. Can't wait to get another couple of pairs. Right. Toyota 86 is the car. This one. Uh, what's my qualifying time? I did Oh, I'm down here. 17.5. Okay, there's room for improvement. Trevisio with the 16.4. Okay, let's jump in. Let's go with the 86, play it safe, but then... Ooh, quite a lot of... I mean, I don't know what car can really challenge the 86 around here. 4C, possibly? We'll see. Let's join in. Let's... Let's jump into a race, we'll see what people are people are using. Did you watch the Spa 24 hours? I watched uh parts of it. Um I watched probably about the first hour. Honestly, what are we doing? Racing or pick rock? Thank you, Jake, for the 164 bottle. Just a reminder of things to come, I, I suppose. The bottling is going to commence at some point. Why are the socks not in your equipment list? Yeah, they're most the, they're the most important part of the setup, obviously. What another R4M member here? Look, R4M Jim sitting in ninth place. Yeah, the Spa 24 was an interesting one because of all the rain. Um, don't know what to make of it really. I didn't really watch any of the last half of the race, so. But yeah, it it got called off for a while, didn't it? I think that's the that's the that's the thing that can happen at Spa. The weather is very questionable. Jess R. Devon in chat, hello. But yeah, Willow Springs. Um We've had a fair few run-ins around this track in, in the past. As I said earlier, if you're off the track. You are off the track. You're not coming back for a long time. The hard track to really get it right though, it's, it looks fairly simple because it's not got too many corners, but it's actually fairly technical, quite a hard one to get right. Pretty 
was breaking too early. But yeah, the F1 has been pretty mad, wasn't it? The last three races have all been really good. German Grand Prix was absolutely crazy. It was like really hard to keep track of what was going on. But they need to... Um, that tarmac on the outside of the last two corners, that was absolutely lethal. Like there was just zero grip. Even people who, who went onto it at like five miles an hour, they weren't they weren't stopping. They were just carrying on into the wall. But they need to install that stuff everywhere. Creating carnage. Quinton, hello, hello everyone. Thank you all for uh, for joining. Good to see you all again. I had a week off last week, essentially, from uh, streaming. It was um. I wanted to have a break after the Spa 24 hour. Um, but also, it was just way too hot. I was like, oh, I'm gonna die if I stream. I'm gonna relax. I should use a pad for the cart. Maybe we could try that actually. I could do um, one, one race on the wheel, one on the pad, and kind of see how it compares. Yeah, there are certain vehicles on this game where using the controller is actually better. The Claire's mistake was a bit silly, yeah, but I mean, a lot, of, a lot. To be fair, a lot of drivers made the same mistake. It, it wasn't easy out there. Even Hamilton span off or crashed into the wall. He got lucky that he could carry on, I suppose. Hulkenberg, Perez span, Verstappen span, but just kept it on. Bot Bottas, obviously. Get in there, Lewis. Miracles do happen, mate. Thank you, Sean Tyler. Always good to hear, man. Always great to get our first victory. I think the first victory is always the hardest one because you never know if you can quite do it. And then once you've done it, you get the confidence and then you, you can do more. You know what it feels like to win. So hopefully that continues for you, mate. But yeah, it's always good when um, the top two just wipe each other out. Get a free uh, overtake, nice and easy. Yeah, it was um, it was a very good race, the German Grand Prix. Let's hope Hungary can uh, spring a surprise, maybe with some rain. It has rained there in the past, because it normally in the dry it's never not, not normally a great race in the dry. A Red Bull could do well around there. They normally quite good in the handling kind of circuits. We'll see. Adeyemi Innis. Adeyemi repping the 12 badge member for 12 months. Adeyemi loves the Super GT content. Get in there, Lewis. Miracles do happen, mate. JSR Devon, ZAR14. Um, I think that's the first time I've ever got that currency sent over. Thank you very much, JSR. Devon, have some worthless currency. Is that worth, like, half a pence? How much is 14 ZAR worth? Or can you even use it? What is the currency of South Africa? ZAR? What is it? I didn't think it was that. Was that how... I don't know. Okay, I had a look on the Rans. internet, and yeah. this was on it. Whoa! Benjamin Ford, if you like Super GT, I think Mike said yes, or Devon or Johnson Racing. Yes, definitely check Johnson Racing, definitely check JSR Devon. 
It's one dollar rand. Is yeah. Okay. Yeah, go and check those guys out for sure. For sure. We've made many videos together over the years. Oh my god, that lap time is awful. I thought I was going quite quickly. Obviously not. 17.5, need to get down to 16 at least, really. Right. F4H Super GT. I think I need to revive um, Shadow, don't I? R4M Shadow GT. In fact, if you look out tomorrow's video, you will see Shadow GT make a reappearance. Um, well, I always want to start by saying a big thank you to all this, this crowd. I mean, you guys have been amazing. Thank you, uh, Clockberg. I've never been interested in racing, but I binge watch your videos. Appreciate your content. Keep it up. Thank you very much. Glad to hear it. And that's something I've heard quite a lot, actually, recently. Um, people interest not interested in motorsport or racing or they had no interest in it before but they watch the videos which is cool to be fair must be doing something right presumably well we're going to start near the back then see what we can do I'm going to try and overtake someone by doing that. <laughs> Look at that guy. That's quite a good overtaking method, I think. Wow. Alrighty then. Let's do it. 14 ZAR is 81 pence. Okay. I won't spend it all at once. Right, let's do it. Meme review. This is going to be an absolute meme. Meme of a race. Um, da, 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 da. Shut, Shut up, up and load, load up. up. Eliminate the other players. Oh, baby, stay cool. We're bringing you the white visor. Stay cool. We're in a good position. Thank you, bleep, bleep, dap. Your videos are seriously addictive, ma amazing stuff. Thank you very much. Glad you like them. Thanks for the donation. All right, let's do it. Send some people to the Shadow Realm. Ooh. Almost sent him. Right. Come on, people. Start knocking each other off. Come on, Bahamas Racing. Five laps. I'm the number one car in the race. And I'm starting 14th. Shocking. Give me that inside line. That Lambo's got some power. See ya! Don't do it, mate. Just stay there. Stay behind. Team orders.
accelerate earlier out of that corner. Oh, there, this race isn't very long, is it? I don't have much time to really get anything done. Must qualify better. I thought my lap was alright, obviously it's not. Rambo's still with me. Oh, someone's off. Oh, Jesus Christ, I didn't expect that. Thank you. Thank you, Messmeister. The new Corvette. Um, I wasn't. I'm not initially keen on it. I must be honest. Just purely on looks. I don't know any of the stats about it. Power, whatever. I haven't seen the interior. Am my... I? Oh my god. I don't. I don't really like the exterior. If I'm honest, not too much. Um, yeah, it's all right, I suppose. <laughs> well, this race is awful. There's a big group there, but they're not killing each other. I need to rename the, the live stream Embracing the Cleanliness. Oh, no. Someone hit each other up. They hit each other up there. The so next up is going to be the Group One race at Maggiore. Maggiore. Have a good fun. Hopefully. Ferrari's off. It's it's Charles Leclerc. Okay, we can get tenth here. It's on now, mate. some close racing why how we didn't make contact through there at all I don't know that's 17.5 my qualifying time oh he's bottled it Anyway, look, I went on the internet this week and I found this. Did just go fudge? Let me read that in just a moment. Okay, I tried to read that too early. Like an absolute idiot, now I'm gonna lose a position. Cheat. All I can do is go to the inside and hope for the best. He's around me. Oh no, and not this guy as well. You have to go around the outside there, mate. Well, that was an absolute disaster, wasn't it? Lol. Wow, okay, I need to work on that. I, I do think I need to work on group four a lot, actually. Um, let me just read that donation, sorry. Du, du, du. Just got Gran Turismo. What cars would be your first places in Group 3 and 4? Toyota? <laughs> you 
You can't go wrong with Toyota. 86 in Group 4. If you had to buy one car in both, Toyota 86 in Group 4 and a Supra in three. Probably your best shout. Honestly, what the f are we doing here? What the f are we doing here? Thank you, ESPC, for the $2. Group one, here we go. Quite anyway, look, oh. I went on the internet this week and I found this. John Washington. Had one of the best seats there. Sad to see Lewis do so poorly, but turns 15, 16 were brutal in the wet. C8 Corvette is awful. So you're actually at the race. Good stuff. Must have been a bit confusing, maybe, in the stand. Just what's going on? Like, at least on the TV, you can see all the positions. But sometimes, maybe sitting in the stands, you're just kind of lost as to what's going on. But it must have been a great experience to see everyone binning it at that final corner. Absolutely binning it. Good stuff, mate. I was thinking about going. Um, but I couldn't get... My friend, my friend basically lives in Frankfurt. One of my friends from school moved to Frankfurt. He invited me about a week ago. Or a little over a week ago. But by then it was too late. There weren't really any uh, seats left. Would have been good to go though. Right, now I've seen people for this race, so the qualifying, uh, people using the R18, Alpine VGT is up there as well. But I think in the race, the Toyota is a very good car. Group 1 should be LMPs only. Yeah, it's a weird mix. LM uh, group 1 is a very strange class, because you've got the LMP1 cars, you've got the VGT cars, and then you've got the Group C cars, and they're all very different. It's just It makes for weird races. Kind of a wacky class to be honest but i think a lot of the time the group uh sorry the lmp1 cars are the best cars so i'm gonna try xbox livery now we'll, we'll go we'll go the toyota first we can try a few of them anyway we got all day we got all night Yeah, any fuel saving races in Group 1, Toyota is your best bet. Bit of qualifying in there. Oh, yeah. Thank you all for joining, guys. Much love, everyone. But yeah, I had a week off okay, last I week. I had a look on the internet, and this was on it. Whoa! Mr. Hebo, thank you for the donation. Did some dailies, but game crashed. DNF like Ricardo's Renault. I'll let you do the enjoyment. Thank you very much. Yeah, you can... Carry on your Grand Turismo legacy through this very live stream. You don't have to play it, you can just watch me do it. Probably better. Probably isn't, but it's your only alternative, I guess. Felipe, baby, stay cool. We're bringing you the white visor. Stay cool. We're in a good position. Thank you, Sam Jackson. Um, yes, it'll be very good. Yeah, so uh, when is it? In two weeks? 10th of August, I think it is. It's a Saturday in about two weeks' time. I think it's the 10th of August. Um, the WTF1 Grand Prix is a little car event. I say little, it's actually quite a big car event. Um, an hour long race in my team. Um, it's on my Instagram, I'll show you again. Um, we're practicing with them the other day. So that is Jimmy on the left, Mr. Jimmy B. And then in the middle is Matt Amos. He's um, a videographer for Formula e, in Formula E. Uh, for the uh, uh, what are they call Virgin team, so he travels around Formula E events. So that's our team. It's just a it's a good fun event. The one hour race, um, two driver swaps. So we all do twenty minutes each, roughly. But it's all for the fun, really, isn't it? All for the fun. Um, but yeah, it's good fun. Um, we did a little practice session together. Um, when was that? Wednesday. It was absolutely bacon. It was too hot. It was too hot for karting, really. But um, yeah, that's in two weeks' time. Hopefully, I might see some of you down there. Um, I also want to say, though, um, so over the weekend, I was at Rye House uh, karting Club 100. And maybe six or seven people. Um, came up to me 
and you know just said oh watch your videos thanks for the thanks for the videos they're really helpful or whatever um that's so actually pretty cool you know just have real life recognition um yeah it's pretty cool but thank you for that okay one thirty seven one. I think that was quite a good lap actually. But I can definitely do a thirty six. And stars what are they doing? Thirty five six. And the Alpine, he's just done that. Yeah, he's just done that in the last minute. And something I just noticed, does anyone someone could probably explain this. I've gone back down to A plus S. So I'm no longer a member of the SS. Adolf has personally kicked me out of the SS. I'm now just A plus S. I'm guessing... It used to be just be you keep SS forever, but... I guess my showing in the last FIA season wasn't good enough. So, I haven't kept it. Been demoted to A plus. Yeah, I'm going to have to work to get that back. I haven't done too many FIA races recently, actually. But um have to jump back in. Right, let's do a lap or so of practice and then we have the race. But this is a fuel saving race, I think. You can't go to the end on one tank of fuel. It's, it's a weird one, it's kind of, you can do no stop, you can do one stop. The pit lane here is quite short. Well, that's a good start, isn't it? And you can put soft tyres on. Which I will do for the race. British spy gets kicked out of the SS. 2000, 1944 colorized. Easy on the trigger there, Super GT. Yeah, there's a little bit. I was, I'm used to the, I did a couple of laps in the R18 earlier. And that car is like completely the opposite. You press the throttle and it just completely understeers. It just goes straight. This car just oversteers. So, I got that wrong. Hopefully my grid slot's a little bit better than the last race. That'd be nice. So just a note on um, channel members. Obviously, thank you to anyone who is a channel member. Thank you for your support, as always. Um, if you want your name in the outro, at the end of the live streams, at the end of the videos. Actually, at the end of the live streams. Um, now is a good time, because I do it at the start of every month. And we're almost coming up to the start of the next month. But obviously, as always, channel membership is just, if you want to do it, then do it. I'm not going to put a gun to your head. I might, I might do actually. I might start putting guns to people's heads just to make sure that they actually do it. Um, but I'll think about it. I might start off with knives, putting knives around their neck, but then I might migrate to guns eventually. We'll see. Yeah, when I get back into the SS, I'll start putting my MP40 to people's heads. Become a member! In a German accent, 
obviously. Just lie down, turn the wheel, and if you want to win, go a little bit faster than all the others. Yes, I heard the news about the Hockenheim circuit. Um, might be the last one for a while, unfortunately, because it's produced two very good races in a row. We'll have to see, I suppose. Oh man, we've got some big names in here. I mean, uh, the top five are all in the top ten times. Uh, this man in sixth place is on top of my friends list. Bottle GT in seventh, reminding me what to do. So we are less, than, and we've got key at the back of the pack as well. Interesting. Where's the rich energy at? Yeah, I've still how many have I got left? I bought a crate of twenty-four. I still have about twenty or eighteen left. Got quite a few left still. Should we try the nose stop here? I reckon try the nose stop. See if it can work. So it's 11 laps, you need to use, therefore, 9% per lap. That would equal 99%. And then you've got that 1% spare. I'm good at maths, me. Well, they haven't said that, I joke, but maths was usually one of my strongest subjects at school, I would say. Oh, God, I'm on the mediums. What do I? Uh, I'll change it now. We're going to do the no stop then. <laughs> Obviously, um, changing my tyres wasn't one of my stronger subjects at school, though. I've got like an E in that. That was my worst subject. How much did you pay for the rich energy? It was like £19 for a crate of 24 off of Am you buy on Amazon. Right, let's have a look then. This is going to be tricky. Right, um, I've got to put the radar on. It's kind of annoying. Um, I'd love it if you could... I want the radar and the fuel at the same time. Because you kind of do need to have the radar on. Oh, I love the classic Toyota livery on that car I had, the red one. Nice. Valve stock. Spaniard is a bit aggressive, isn't he? Take it nice and easy here. Maybe a little bit too easy, if anything. Be a bit more aggressive. GT3 memories, yes. Anything with that Toyota GT1. It's a blast from the past. Whoa, there's a giant lizard on the track. Thank you there. Um, I couldn't quite pronounce your name. Seven approved of the start. DJ Aiden YG, thank you very much. How much fuel do I use there? Oh, um, yeah, 9%. Actually, I don't think, yeah, you probably don't have to fuel save too much then, as someone did comment. There's a big queue of cars here. Look at that. 
We are not out of this. We are very much in it. In it, bruv. Flag, someone's off. Hey, oh. spirit again. That wants to go past, not going to fight him. Take it, mate. Someone else on the inside. Ah, what are they doing? Bunch of Egypt, mate. Mate, just go past and stop being an idiot. Feels good. We can rev this out a lot more, I think. Let's attack a little bit. Felipe, baby, stay cool. We're bringing you the white visor. Stay cool. We're in a good position. Thank you, Nicholas. Thank you very much. Super GT languishing down near the back ain't good enough long race though waiting for people to pit as well penalty for this guy Fuel, 75%. We're good. Oh, there's contact behind. Just saw that on the radar. Nicholas. Start playing Forza because of me. Good stuff. I always like that, you know. People get into games after seeing some of the videos. I've, I've played Forza for so long. I've been a, a long affair with Forza. This is Forza 2. 2007 started playing it. a long time. I'm just hoping Forza 8 can really bring some big changes to the series though. Honestly, what the f*** are we doing here? I assume with the 20 quid. Spack the lift here is back. 
How are you doing, my friend? Is that really you? Is that you? Mr. Spack the Liftier returns. The grand return of the Asim. What steering wheel am I using? Um, Fanatec McLaren GT3. Honestly, what the f are we doing here? On the CSL Elite base. Keith Kingdom was sweaty balls. Yeah, it has been rather roasty last uh, couple of days, isn't it? Or last week it was, anyway. Thank you very much, Scott Mansfield. Hey, are people pitting? I think, so, I think one person did. Yeah, Mammal just went in. Got a key behind me now. Got me into ramming. Are you, are you a member of R4M, I, I guess? past come on son oh these tires are going off okay, everyone's going in now See you later, everyone. Oh, key staying out with me. That's Cuba Tom, I think. Oh, my God. What the hell happened there? Oh, we got a four second penalty for that. Well, I'm gonna have to watch that back. I wasn't even sure what happened there. Got a four second battery. Rip. He's not gonna be happy with that. There's no way he deserved that penalty. It was just a. Uh, I don't know. Did I? At what? I mean, he didn't cause it. It's just. I don't know. We'll have a look at it. I don't know. We'll have a look. I can't really even remember what happened. It just looks a bit weird. I have all the big boys coming back through now. Saw him come up the inside, just let him go. Mammals. I don't know this guy. He's just come out of the. He's just come out of nowhere in the last few weeks and just been absolutely ridiculously fast. Oh, 
god. Yeah, I don't know if I don't know if I can make a one stop really work. So what four laps? Let that guy go. That's Cuba serving his penalty. He's still gonna be ahead of me, even with a four second penalty. See how much time he gained on that lap. Let him go. Don't want to ruin his race. Oh boy, this is <laughs> this isn't going well. Why not fuel left? Should have. Big group of four people there. That more to the back. As I think, I think the biggest thing about this race is the tyres rather than the fuel. You need. I just can't go around these corners as anywhere as quick as these guys. Tires are just gone. Oh, I can't even drive this car. Felipe, baby, stay cool. We're bringing you the white visor. Stay cool. We're in a good position. Spack the lift here. The meme returns. Where did I start? 14th? 12th? I'm going to be lower down than that by the end. We're ninth now. Yeah, it looks like the one stop is quicker it looks like it's quicker but it's only early in the week things can change we never quite know just yet yellow flag oh that spaniard's off see ya the self send it looked like first class delivery to the realm to the spaniard the one they call the Spaniard. Oh, big group now. Look at the understeer into there. I believe this on me even on medium tires is actually very bad. There's no point in peeing now. It's too late. Yeah, ball GT's just gone past. Just a reminder of the situation. Fuel's actually alright in this car. So yeah, this no stop is not ridiculous. This Halmstar is still behind me there. He pitted. And I've got one lap to go. So I, th I think a no stop is very... It's not too far off, actually. We'll see as the week goes on. It might become the best strategy.
we go then. Oh, guy behind just span off, I think. One lap to defend. I'm actually higher up than I started. On the internet, and this was on it. Oh, oh. God, no grip. Thank you very much, Turbo. <laughs> yeah, when it's raining, though, you can never expect anything. It was just absolute carnage out there. Oh, right. Thank you very much. Three second penalty. In fact, you're probably... He's going to finish more than three seconds ahead of me. That actually won't even affect me. It won't affect him. Now I'm going to get a penalty for that. Absolute joke. <laughs> He's one of those laugh cries. We don't know what to do. Bit of both. That's a major roof. Big roof. He was all over the freaking grass trying to pass me there. And he bounced off of me into the wall. <laughs> he must be an R4M. Ah, oh, man. Isn't this man with the win from sixth place on the grid? Good stuff. Cuba Tom will probably ruin. Uh, ru well, we'll see on the rebound then. Yeah, that was um, interesting. Yeah, well done, this man. Great race, mate. Came through to win by, well, it was very close, two tenths of a second. Very, very close. Have your said thank you to me. Um, yeah, no worries. Yeah, I need to move that brake balance back. I did in the end, but I don't know why. I guess it was for qualifying. Felipe, baby, stay cool. We're bringing you the white visor. Stay cool. We're in a good position. Don't worry, mate. It wasn't your fault, Turbo. You didn't curse me. I cursed myself. Let's have a look. Let's just take a look at that replay. Do an absolute travesty of a race that was. Have I streamed race B yet? Yes, I did that first. But, uh... I need to qualify a bit better for that one. I was actually quite low on the grid. Yeah, I'll do the cards. Wait, what's the time? Got five minutes quickly. Let's have a look at this. We take a look at this replay, and then we've got the cart race. Yeah. Cart race is going to be fun. It's going to be carnage. I don't know why I have to watch this start thing these days. Not this too bad on these races, but on the, on the daily race, you have to sit through like two minutes. Going through the whole grid. Um, what did you, oh yeah, the Cuba Tom thing. Sorry. I can't. It's happened so quickly. I can't even remember what happened. When he came out of the pit lane, wasn't it? End of lap five. No, end of end of five. Yeah. Right. Or the end of. Six. 
end of six, going into seven. It just came out there. I knew it was their game. Right. Mm. Oh, we're both going across each other. I was going left still, he was going right. But it's just weird, like, it shouldn't have been a penalty, it should have just been uh, a racing incident to carry on. So that's, that's the kind of thing where the penalty system just gets it wrong completely. Yeah, I was looking backwards. There was that one first. I mean, was that necessary? I don't think he was on the track. Let's have a look at that. I mean, I knew he was not on the track. Everyone was saying he was on the, he was on the track. He wasn't. I gave him space as well, look. He had the curb and half the track. Half a cart whip on the track. And then he said thank you to me because of his stupid driving. Ah, oh, these idiots. I mean, I'll say I was kind of half at fault for the first one, but oh well. Let's go kart. Let's go go karting now. How many different paints are there? There's loads. Thirty-two. Let's go red. Skyline with a six. How you doing, man? Good to see you again. Yeah, group one is carnage. It's an absolute mess. Hopefully, my ratings don't get affected too badly. But to be fair, I don't. I'm not too bothered about the ratings these days. Oh, I can't even start this one. Just missed it. Just missed it. As long as he touched that orange, it's not a penalty. Yeah, but it's still just crap driving to go that far off the grass. It's still a bit out of control. Then he's just... The angle he's going to go, come across the track, it means he can't negotiate the right bit quickly. I gave him space. I didn't do anything wrong. He, he just dealt with the problem. He dealt with the situation really badly. Honestly, what the... What are we doing here? If he had been more patient, he, he should have seen that I was so bad on the tyre, he would have gone past me easily. Minute Logic, can I get a shout out and thanks for the videos? Um, I suppose you're on the screen right now. I said your name, there's your shout out, and thank you. Thank you very much. Right, Carton. This is um this is always a very strange race because the um the slipstream really counts for a lot. If you lose it, you lose, basically. Let's put it that way. Can I get a shout out on your next next disc track? My my next disc track is all about you, Dibbler all about you i've got a whole album dedicated to dissing you salty gt i've always hated that so it's salty if the other guy i mean i was get i was getting nowhere in that race it doesn't matter the other guy was like oh thank you mate okay <laughs> you, i had a look on the you're internet shit driving and this was it. on it Whoa! I got waped. Otherwise, I would have been racing with you. Waped? You got waped? 
Next time, mate. Oh my god. I do need to improve these qualifying times. He's not good enough. Starting ninth. Oh, we've got Dibbler. He's here. Is it better to drift in karting or brake and position the kart smoothly? Really depends on the kart, but dr I mean drifting. I don't think drift. No, you wouldn't drift. You might slide the car a bit. I don't know if drifting is the right word. Yeah, that qualifying is not good. I spent about five minutes on each track doing qualifying. Obviously, not enough. Power sliding. I mean, a lot of cars you want to say dead smooth and not slide at all. It really depends on the car. Um... I get this question a lot, and I get a lot of comments on the karting videos um, saying, oh, you should drive it like this, but and then I ask them, what carts are you driving? And they're driving a different cart. And it's like, okay, well, that cart you'll drive like that, but this cart you drive differently. So it's, it's really just a case of whichever cart you're driving. But drifting, I don't know if drifting is the right word. Not like Tokyo drift, you know, you wouldn't be doing 90 degree drifts around all the corners. Bit that way. Right, let's go out for a bit of practice. Good start. Pro tip: cross the finish line in first place to win. Right, let's let's give that a go. Let's give it a go. We've got some new amazing advice. Oh, yeah, TCS, I'll turn that off. Here we go, guys. Oh, man. Let the games begin. Oh, hello. I can feel my SR going down. I'm in sixth. Gain positions. It's only five laps, it's a quick race. Fifth now. On the way outside. Good move, to be fair. So twitchy. Put like minimal steering in. Otherwise, you're going round. Oh, thanks, mate. That's actually held me. Oh, boom! Look at this. He's got defensive. It's got to come out anywhere. We've got a love affair with the Spaniards today.
A nice gap behind. Two laps to go. Second place is on. He dropped off a little bit. I do need to catch up with this group again, mate. A little bit off. That was a little bit close. Uh, somehow we did a 360 and kept going. Still in sixth place, I suppose. Not too bad. Be worse. I think you just lost it on the curb. Yeah, that shifting animation's like two seconds too late after I actually pressed the gear change. One last lap. Jesus Christ. Oh, the whole pack's on me now. Yellow flag, someone spun it. Come on, give me fifth place. He's got a penalty anyway. See ya! Fifth place after all that. Gonna let it mess up the final corner. Oh man. Do cars not have pedal shifters? Pedal shifters? Never heard of pedal shifters. If you mean paddle shifters, um, normally they no, they normally always have a stick. Oh, fifth <laughs> man, that was a chaotic race. Somehow it came through in fifth. Um, I'll take that. To be fair, there was a quite a lot going on. Yeah, I seem to have a love affair with the, Sp with the Spanish players today. My controller, yeah, that's a good shout actually. I think be worth a crack at controller on that. Right, oh, I think we just missed race. Ah, yeah, we missed it by like 30 seconds or something. Ah, or less than. Sorry. We can improve our qualifying time though. I think I need to do that. So let's let's do that. Let's, in fact, let's watch a replay. Let's watch a top replay. Improve our time. Get in there, Lewis. Miracles do happen, mate. WTF Fick. Thank you very much for the donation. Um, the message didn't come up for some reason. Whenever I tune in, why are you bottling it? I'm bottling because you tune in. I've just got sensors for your presence. All right, let's have a look, Ben. See what he's doing. Good evening, Trevisio. All right. 75 meters. Fourth gear. Way to the outside. This is the hardcore, I think. Well, they're all pretty hardcore. Those fourth gear. Full power quite early on in the corner. Tijney! I better be going to Salzburg. Um, we'll see. I haven't been invited yet. But I'm going to New York, that's all I know. Why watch the replay? You can load the go load up a ghost in the qualifying lobby. It's not the same. Because of this, you can pause it. You can see... 
their uh, throttle input, when they're braking, their gears, you can't see that on a Ghost. So that's why. There's a braking here just before 50. On 50 pretty much. Third gear, sliding the car a little bit. Our, this is a tricky one. Out wide, down to second, come back for a late apex there. Power out. Down there. Swing it around on the power just after the apex. It's good to see Tishney in the chat. Hope all is well. Give it a nice to the right hand side, over to the left. Where does it break? Just before 150. Swing it into the right. How oh, nice and early. It's a really difficult corner that. And then drive straight to the line. To the left. Oh. Replay just left us there for some reason. Right, let's give that a go and presumably fail at it. I'll keep tabs of the time. About 16 minutes or so. Yeah, the Toyota's um, distinctly overpowered. Someone's doing some little dealing with uh, Liffany. Under the counter dodgy dealing to promote their cars. BBC for Mini Madness. I do need to, yeah. I've had to look at one of those races. It does look very good fun, actually. Um, well, I always want to start by saying a big thank you to all this, this crowd. I mean, you guys have been amazing. Brandon, my best fan. You've been amazing. Thank you so much once again, my friends. Yeah, that manufacturer series looks a little bit. Um, I saw that. Um, who was it? Lightning was having trouble qualifying. Because he's. Subaru brand around the world wasn't doing too well. That's way too good. We'll get there. I think based on the last lap, uh, based on the last race, sorry, I need to um, get in the 16s at least. Not all too early. Let's get back off again. I always want to start by saying a big thank you to all this, this crowd. I mean, you guys have been amazing. Jeffrey Sanders for the $20. Wow, thank you very much, mate. Um, don't bend and go into the Shadow Realm. That's, that's good advice, to be fair. That's advice to live by. Thank you very much for the reminder. Not to bend myself to the Shadow Realm.
God, I'm not good at this track. Or any track, for that matter. What a lap. Thank you, uh, Mr. Kalshik. Missing the fours of bowling videos lately. Yeah, I do need to go back on there. Felipe, baby, stay cool. We're bringing you the white visor. Stay cool. We're in a good position. Show your feet to 2K viewers. If we get to 3K, I'll show them. Turn that ghost off. Get in there, Lewis. Miracles do happen, mate. <laughs> you did say, yeah. Sorry. I just sent myself to the Shadow Realm for you. Come on, let's get a good lap. This is rubbish. Too early again. Seventeen eight. Three times lost already. It's a weird track, it's just like... Sometimes you feel like you're getting it right, but it's just like so far off the pace. I hate this track now because I'm crap at it. Oh man, I don't know the line. I can't get it right. Uh, is this, what's up with the stream, is it? We'll go again. Refresh the stream, guys. Should be all right. It's not loading. I don't know what happened there. I'm not getting any notifications that anything's wrong. Try following the ghost of P1. Well, that's a good shout, actually. Yeah, I do need... Uh... No ghost. Let's follow the ghost of Trevisio. Done. Okay. Yeah, this is something I would always do on Forza, just follow a fast ghost. You do kind of get pulled around by it. And gain a few taps by doing it. Let's give it a try. I haven't actually used this feature yet. Um, 
You can load up a top 10 ghost. Follow them around. By follow, I mean just gets absolutely well and truly trounced by it. At least you can see the lines. See the ideal line. And you can see the, the crap line my, my previous ghost was taking. See where I'm losing time by studying the ghost. How do I turn my ghost off and not the other one? I don't know, but hopefully I'll be ahead of my one anyway. At least that's the idea. See ya! Right. Come on in. Let's have a good one. Nowhere near the apex. A bit late on the throttle. late turning in I do need to work in group 4 a lot um, I'm much better in group 3 oh man wait was that my record my first lap was actually my record somehow track wait let me turn my ghost off I'd rather race a samba bus than this um oh, where's the ghosts I never oh ghost settings that's the best off again Oh man, this stupid fucking track. Hate it. Ah, oh, we just need to just have to keep lapping it to get good at it. That's there's no other way. There's no other way. Oh, it's actually not too bad there. Yeah, um, I've got probably time for one more lap. Going too, too, too early into that one. Just 
16, 17, 6. This is uh, not too bad though. I can just get the final corner right. Uh, low. 17, that I'll have to do, and I'm going to have to back out and go into the race. 17, 2, okay, a bit better. I just need to put in like 10, 20 minutes, and I'll probably get a lot better, but that was an improvement. Believe me, baby, stay and, uh, cool, we're bringing you the white visor, stay cool, we're in a good sixth position. Sixth place on the, on the grid, obviously. Get good, mate, and you won't hate the track. It's true. Very true. But, as it stands, I hate the track, so... I'll moan about it. Thank you, Chris Miller. It's a it's a hard combo as well because um it's like Group Four and I'm not. Do they ever do they ever do Group Three at this track? I'm just trying to recall. It's normally, always Group Four at Willow Springs. I can't remember um ever doing Group Three here. Maybe they have done it at some point, but. I think Route 3 will be a maybe a little bit too fast for that track. Yeah, mainly Group 4. Will the new update have a new track? No idea. Um, well, they haven't said there would be, but they often don't always say which what's coming out. They normally just release the cars, but they don't say what track's coming out. Not always, anyway. Not that I can remember, but I don't know. We'll have to see. Pretty sure you used a C7R a while ago. Yeah, I th oh, what was that video? Zero Respect Shown, I think it was called. Fourth in turn two. I'm pretty sure I was in fourth. I'll go in in fifth and then down to fourth. Pretty sure I was in fourth gear. Tomahawks VGT around that track. Can you imagine? Can you imagine that? That'd be absolute carnage. The only track preview I can remember is St. Croix. Yeah, that's the only one I can remember as well. They actually had a nice little couple of videos out before the track came out. I'm pretty sure. We'll see. Um, it's been a little bit differently, re different recently, because normally, w w from when the game came out, there were a lot of there was like a track every month for a while. Um, but recently, there's so sometimes they don't have one, sometimes they do. So it's all a bit all over the place at the moment. We'll have to see. I think I think it's Thursday. The update is coming out, so. I have to see. I don't know. I mean, I don't know more than anyone else. I don't, you know, I don't work for the game or anything. I just, whatever happens, happens. Another karting video soon. Yes. Um, oh. I think Ericsson hit us. Um, all you can change is the brake bias. Um, you can't change the setup of the car. We can change brake bias and traction control if you call that setup. I suppose brake bias is setup, traction control is just a setting, I suppose. But you can't change the setup per se. Well, yeah, maybe I wasn't quite fifth, holding it in fifth. 
them back. Yeah, it's just. Hmm, I don't know. I think I landed and he funded me just at that moment. What BB is good? Um, I think slide to the back on this car. I'm not sure. Yeah, a lot of people ask me this. Um, what setup is good for this car? Um, you should change your setup because obviously it's not work well you can't change it out um, this game really works on balanced performance most of the time so you don't actually change the setup and to be fair I, I really like that um, the BAP isn't always perfect in fact it really isn't always perfect at all but um, I've done race series on Forza where like leagues online leagues where try plus four I tried online leagues where it, tuning is allowed and it just comes down to who can tune for the longest and the best. It, I, I don't like that really. This is one thing I like about Gran Turismo, you can just jump on and play it and don't have to worry about that. Right, starting a little bit further up this time, 8th place rather than uh, 14th or whatever it was. can make up some ground. This Ferrari's uh, lagging a little bit. on the inside, fair enough. Oh mate, get wrecked. Get onto the back of this group. That was a good move. Although to be fair, he just kind of backed out of it. Made it easy for me. I mean, a move like that, half the time it's like, you just go for it and just, if you're up against a really good driver knows what they're doing, you won't get past because they'll deal with it in the right way, but he just backed out, <laughs> just gave me the position almost. The half of it was him just driving badly. Really need to sort that last corner out. Travisio in here, sitting in third place at the moment. In the blue car. Oh, it's all kicking off there. We're on them now. Travisio up to second.
Come on, I don't want to finish the second place again. Take that, thank you. I'm in the slipstream still. Jimmy Bondini, the German Jimmy Broadbent. Come on, let's get fourth. Nice gap behind as well. Poor exit there. Come on, don't bottle the final corner now. Oh, Trevisio has gone for it up there. I think he's just got it. Great move. Oh, he's going to get passed back though. Well, let's see how close that was on the line between Trevisio for second. Oh, Ooh, yeah, very close. We've done a tenth, half a tenth. Oh, there we go. A couple of good moves in there. Up to fourth from, where is it, eighth? Where did I start? Eighth, I think. Happy with that. Oh, that was tough. But enjoyable. Anyway, look, I went on the internet this week and I found this. Neil Thomas, thank you for becoming a member on the channel. Thank you very much. Thank you to all my members. Oh, I think it's 100 and... How many? 122 of you? 122 members. Very good. Thank you very much, guys. And welcome, Neil Thomas. What well on Trevisio? Good, good pass at the end there. Nice send, yeah. Right on that last corner, he just went for it. And it was, I thought you were going to make contact, but somehow he didn't. It's good stuff. 17-4 in the race. Save that replay. Um, Miguel was very quick. Seven. He got a nice gap at the start, got away from people. So well done to him. Tijni, always good to see you in the chat, my friend. Um, I'll see you again very soon. Hopefully, I'll actually see you for real at Red Bull Ring. Hopefully. Hey, oh my god. This is the kind of the annoying thing about these races. They need to like stagger them a little bit differently because like you do race A and then when it finishes you can't quite make race B. I think Ericsson hit us. Thank you number 95. Good race Steve. I bottled it in the last corner. Don't worry mate. I, I bottled it. I bottled it on I think it was lap 2. Bottled it. Um, it's very easy to do. But yeah, Willow Springs is one that it's a really tricky circuit really uh, one of the hardest i think in the game to get dead right so i think i improved there 17 2 my qualifying time i could do a 16 i know that but just need to put a lot of time a lot of time into 
getting some consistent laps in. Jack Waterman, thank you very much for the comment, mate. Um, I mean, we just, just. I mean, I'm going to try it now. Just continue. I'm not going to enter the. Right. I want to do race one again. I'll just improve my lap time here, and then we can go back into race one. So I know I can get a 16 around it. When is the Red Bull Ring FIA event? Are you going to New York too? I'm going to New York, which is um, yeah, roughly, I think it's like 24th of August, that 20, the 24, 25, 26, around that, the weekend closest to that of August. Um, and then Red Bull is September 15th, I think. Um, I'm not sure about Red Bull. I haven't been invited to it, but they might ask me later. I don't. I don't know. But yeah, New York. I'll be going to the, the World Tour event. It's it's really cool because um, I've never been to a Gran Turismo World Tour event. There've been plenty of them. I've never had the chance to go to one. So it'd be good to to go see how it all works out. To meet Kaz, hopefully, um, see all the Gran Turismo players as well for the first time. It's strange because I've. I've known so many of the players, like in, um, oh god, I've known so many of the players online, like we've spoken to each other, we've raced each other, we've spoken on Twitter, um, but I've never met any of them, so it'd be good to finally meet a lot of the players. What happened to my S rank? Yeah, I don't know. I actually don't know. I only just realised today that it's gone. I guess... Um, I guess they take it away. Oh, I need to load the ghost. Sorry. Uh, let's just load the top ghost again. And then uh, change... What is it? Like that. And my one is off, yeah. We only want one. Okay, let's try and get 16 at least. Yeah, stringing a whole lap here is, is difficult. It's, uh, it's a weird circuit. Very technical. You need to apply online again. It should just give you the option in the game. If, I mean, I don't know how... What, I don't know what they're doing with it, to be honest. Why I've lost the ranking. I don't know. That corner, I'm losing a lot of time. Just need to get on the power so early because it you're going to lose speed all the way down this straight by getting on the power too late. There's a crucial corner that probably the most important corner, you could say. Okay, that wasn't such a bad lap, actually. Let's we'll see what that is. Hopefully a higher 16 at least. 16, 16, 8, there we go. Anyway, look. I went on the internet this week and I found this. Thank you, Herman, for becoming a member as well. Two new members today, very good stuff. Thank you very much. look on the internet and this was on it whoa Stuart Palmer what have you missed um well the race I just did was actually not too bad um 
Um, well, I always want to start by saying a big thank you to all this, this crowd. I mean, you guys have been amazing. Thank you, Sparta. Luckily, I was on the straight when I read that one. <laughs> thank you very much, Sparta, for the donation. Uh, Stuart, I had a very, very good race just now, actually. Uh, first couple of races weren't great, though. Normally, um, kick off the week, trying to get used to the races, driving them for the first time, not sure what I'm doing. But uh, slowly getting a bit better now. Right, come on. I can beat that 16-8. Wasn't a good exit. Too late on the power. I could probably beat that. I could probably get 16 5, I think, if I got everything right. Take a lot more through there. You can see just how much he type, uh, how much time he gains actually that final corner on the exit especially Your palm up. Could you shout America and you'll next send it? I'll see what I can do for you. Just play the Team America theme tune. Carry a lot more speed. Got to be more brave on the exit. Consistent laps now though. Six. 16 again to be a low 17. This one, yeah. I got the power a little bit too early. Didn't have the line. 16 8 though. You know what? That's not too bad. The consistency was a bit better there as well. Uh, third on my CNF fake taxi. Nice. Um, 16 4 is. Um, okay, 16 4 is top 10 in the world. So I suppose I'm four temps off of top 10. Not too bad. I suppose it's quite a short track, but that's not too bad. I could go two temps quicker, I reckon, as well. Two or three temps, maybe. But um, that's a bit better than what we were doing earlier. I will take that. Can you please go race bar first? Um, no, because I'm doing the daily races here. And Bathurst is not one of them. 
Right. So we're going to go with the strategy that everyone was using on the last race, which was R18, and just gun it. Go for it. Right. Yeah, so the last time... I mean, I think the no-stop can work. It's just very difficult to really get it all correct. Let's give it a practice. Is there any better setup for the controller, i.e. sensitivity settings or something like that? Um, I would say technically more sensitive is better, as you can just turn quicker and react to things quicker. But it's just, it's almost like on Call of Duty where, you know, you could have like max sensitivity and then you just do a 180 in like an instant. It's better technically because you can turn and shoot someone, but it might be too hard to control. So. The best setting is the one that's best for you, really. But try seven to see if you can control it, basically. I think that would be my advice. Try it as sensitive as possible, and if you can't handle it, then put it down. Right. Oh man, a million Discord notifications. Okay, yeah, got six minutes just to this. In the pink livery, Horse India slash Racing Point. Does anyone does anyone actually call them Racing Point? I think everyone still just calls Horse India, don't they? Oh boy! David Coulthard still calls them Force India, yeah. I think a lot of the commentators do that. They say, yeah, Force India. Oh, uh, sorry, racing point. They correct themselves. The racing point, I mean, I don't know. A bit of a dull name. Put it Force Canada. At least this time I have the soft tyres and not the medium tyres in the race. That that cost me, I think. Yeah, the fact that they didn't change the livery doesn't help because you just see the pink and you're right, Falls India. But it's not Falls India. They had a good result though, Lance Stroll was leading the race yesterday, it was pretty mad. And Hulkenberg in a podium place, then binned it. I don't think he would have finished there anyway, but you never know, you never know. Okay, um, my camera's just turned off for some reason. Let me... Oh, I know why. Bear with me a moment here, guys. Bear with me, I've got to change the, the battery. 
rip ripperoni guys While we're here, let's have a look at my setup. Well, I've got the camera out of the thing. That's where I'm sitting. Woo! There's my wheel. Hopefully it's not too laggy. It might be a little bit laggy. Spin deck. Green. That's where you guys are, up there. Yeah, Inception. Um, microphone. Um, the camera sits there. Other screens, keyboard, the rock app, nice one, yeah, white, and my pedals, down there somewhere, down there, there they are, then the other light over here, there, yeah, and my controller, yeah, good stuff, back. Oh, leg reveal. Um, yeah, so basically I was using my camera on the weekend and um, how do I describe it? Normally you just have a normal battery in the camera, right? That battery normally lasts, well, how long does it last? Two hours? That's pretty good going, I suppose. Then it's hard out. But I normally have like a, a dummy battery, which you put in, it's got a wire and it's got a USB and it just lasts forever. Um... But yeah, there we go. Just a quick look at my setup. We're back in the game, though. Uh, oh, 30 seconds until the race starts. What's the name of the TV? Um, oh, I'll call it a monitor rather than a TV, but... Um, what was it? Samsung... I don't know. Samsung LBX1428. Just some long string of letters and numbers, which I can't remember at all. Sexy legs, mate. Thank you, Olympic JM. I did it just for you. Just for you. What console do you use for this? PlayStation 4. This game is only on PlayStation. Right, here we go. Disco reveal. Oh, that's a bit private, don't you think? Right, let's do it. Bottle GT. I've got to beat Bottle GT. If I don't do anything else, I must beat Bottle GT. Can you do the YMCA around the big banky boy? If I'm dominating the race and living by a uh, race and just winning by a mile, I'll do the YMCA. Chances of that happening are basically zero. Right, Bottle GT, you are my number one rival, mate. I can't be having someone. He's he's downright dicking on me with that name, isn't he? He's dicking on me. Dicking all over me. Can't be having that. I cannot let him do that to me. Right. Soft tyres. I've got soft tyres on this time. Yeah, Ball GT is actually very quick. He's a very quick player. So I have my work cut out, especially from 10th when he's 4th. What's the fastest car for here? Well, it looks like the R18 is doing well. But I think it's, sometimes it's too early in the week to tell. 
Because sometimes people come up with better strategies later on. We will find out. What is dicking on someone? It sounds very dodgy, I'll admit that, but it just means, um, how do I say it? He's gently resting his phallus on my head. No, he's, it just means they're like, making you look stupid, I think, is the right way to put it. I think that's the most sensible way to say it. Are you going to try the, try the Toyota? I tried the Toyota earlier on, on, on a no stop and it didn't work, but um, I could try it again with a one stop, I suppose. Right, starting 10 with one aim, beat Bottle GT. Can't be having him beating me. Come on, Force Ninja slash Racing Point slash Sport Pace or whatever. Let's help Stark in his Alpine. I'm going to go around his outside. Someone spun there. I'm up to 8th already. Go. I'll be on Condo McGregor, rep in Ireland. Got some Spaniards in it, just to make things tasty. We love our Spaniards. Where's Bottle? He's in third. Reviso just there in sixth place. Hondo McGregor's going for it. Oh, here we go. This is going to get interesting. Okay. Didn't get too interesting. Oh baby, strong defence. I think Ericsson hit us. Thank you, Hassan. Loving the engine sound. Oh, that curb did kill me. Thank you very much, Hassan, for the donation. We've got Trevisio ahead of us now. Let's try and follow him. Try and get away from this group. Third, Bottle. Come on. Got to beat Bottle. Bottle GT. For dicking on me. For resting his phallus on my head. Slipstream. Feel 10% a lap or 11% a lap roughly at this point. I see the understeer there. It's 
Still lurking behind, about a second, the Spaniard behind me. Ominously lurking there with his one, one bar connection. Come on, Javicio, give me that slipstream, mate. saving I reckon he is I'm not I'm just going for it fuel another 10% use on that lap to fifth that's good so far wide bottom TT down to fourth now Condo McGregor's gone up Rev's still there. I'm understand now. Move that great by a little bit more back. I reckon Trev saved quite a lot more fuel than I have. Catching bottle. Presumably because he's saving fuel, but I don't know. Come on. I want to get him. Hunt him down and kill him. Yeah, coming down to two seconds. So done again. Corner. Second place with a penalty there, or third place. One of them. Oh, that might be a penalty.
mate. Got away with it, I think. Just about. No, so this this lap will be the moment of truth. Let's see what people's um, fuel saving has been like. That's 40. It should be on about 40 by the end of the lap. Oh, car getting a little bit out of control there. So I'll be on about 40% when we go in. We'll see, obviously, on the left-hand side of the screen, people's percentages. Um, the higher, the better. I need to stop doing that around that stupid corner. Okay. Let's see what people are. 41 for the leader. 41, 39. What's bottle? About the same. I'm oh, 42. Actually, my, mine's a little bit better. Tiny bit, anyway. Javicio, 45, yeah. He, he saved a few more than I did. Bottles are 38, so I'll save 4% more than he did. Or she. About 52. Not much. And you can see how that's translated into... A... A game for Javicio. He was behind me, he's jumped ahead. Courtesy of the fuel saving. So we go again for the second half of the race. Come on, Bottle GT. Can you see the chat wall like, uh, while driving? Yes, I can. On the second screen, above my screen. Well, I must have done, otherwise I can't read, can't, couldn't have read that comment. Come on, Javicio, turn me onto the back of Bottle. Bottle GT, I'm coming for you, mate. Smash the bottle. Oh, yellow flag, someone's off. Oh, rip. Where's Key? Key's up in the lead. He's, uh, he's, I'm guessing he's doing a no-stop. That'd be interesting. Oh, Trevisio. That's a penalty, yeah. Uh, unlucky pal. Key now. No, who's that in fifth? Happy Meal. Come on! Oh, stupid curb. Oh, that was dodgy. I cut it. I swear I took that same amount of curve last time. That certainly didn't happen. Oh, bottle stuck behind. He's bottled up behind Happy Mill. Gap 1.7. Keep him there, mate. Keep him there. <laughs> Gap 1.3. I've just gained four tenths.
Uh, what's the gap now? 1.3 still, okay. Come on, this is happening. It's a second now. And we've got Key up there. We'll get past Key as well. Show you, shows the real YouTuber. There can only be one. Much fuel. I need about 25%. I've got 28. It's all right. Come on. I want you now, mate. The pressure's on, mate. Can you deal with it? Can you handle it? We've got key there just to mix things up. We'll catch him by the end of lap 10, probably. On the no stop. Probably even earlier than that we'll catch him, to be honest. Steve, it's James. Punt off bottom GT at the nearest available opportunity. Thank you. Sorry, mate. Come on, this is happening. This is happening, guys. Right now, right before your very eyes. The key there just to really mix things up as well. Come on, give me that slipstream now. Ooh. Yeah, we've caught him now. To be fair, right, Key started like, what, 14 or something? It shows you the no stop can work. It can definitely work. Bottles up the inside. Inside now. There's no way you're coming back through there, mate. Our ball's got a one point two gap now. Trevisio, he's just gone. Don't know where he went. I've got a penalty and then he's just disappeared since. Fuel? Oh, I've, I've overfueled the car, if anything. down to 0.6 it's not going to be enough though to be fair to bottle he hasn't bottled it under immense pressure he did very well he did very well fourth and fifth you know what? That was a good, good. Um, that was a good race. I'm happy with that. Happy with Trevisio got ninth. He was five seconds off me in the end. Nearly six seconds. I got bottled by Bottle GT. He continues to dick on me even now. Bottler versus Bottle. Yeah, and the Bottle won. 
Ah. <sighs> well, at least I didn't actually bottle it. There was that one mistake uh, coming out of the big banky boy. P4 and 5 for team bottle. Hell yeah. Get in there, bottle. Fantastic drive, mate. You are the world bottle champion. Valtteri bottle. Bottle got condoed, though. Condo McGregor. The Racing Point Sport Pacer Force India comes home in fifth. Up five positions. I started ten. Okay, I thought I was, I thought I was eight. Well, well, well. You know what? I'll take that result. I'm happy with that. Fast is 38 5. Lead is doing 37 4. Then three for Zavasic. Nice. Bottle 2, the dickening continues. Sure does. Um, my favourite class on on this game, Group 3, on Forza? Hmm. On Forza, probably S class, I'd say. Well, that was good, wasn't it? That was very good. this one again like 16 they're quite up on my friends list oh that's not too bad r4m gym how many r4m members are here it's one favorite type of racing on irace well i haven't really done it i haven't really played i racing enough but out of the ones i've done probably just GT, but I've only I've, I've really not done too many races, so I can't, it's hard to say. Um, can I do this race again? The go kart. Let's do the kart, I think. But I need to improve my lap time with the kart. But. Get that lap time done because I qualified pretty much last last time. Set friend requests, yeah, maybe, maybe one day. My, I've got too many re uh, friend requests, and I I can't actually get any more. Guys, 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 guys. I heard this was a cat lover channel. No idea where you're getting your rumours from, mate. I find cats weird. I mean, cats... I mean, for the most part, cats are just, you know, they just walk about, sleep, do fuck all, do nothing, whatever. But a lot of the time, they're... They're... Weird animals, honestly. They're like demonic. Some of the thing, some of the, I don't know, just the weird sounds that they make, the way that they punch their back up. They just do weird. They're like not weird, but like freaky stuff, like demonic stuff. Sometimes they are weird animals. Something really, I don't know. There's something demonic about them. Um. That I can't quite explain. I think the Shadow Realm has possessed them. I like dogs better. Dogs are much better. But yeah, cats, I mean... Like a dog, you come home to a dog and it's, it's so happy that you're home. The best thing ever that you've come home. Cat. You come back over to a cat and it's like, oh, not you again. The cat doesn't give a crap who you are. Right, just give him my food. Piss off.
Are you calling my Garfield demonic? Yes, I am. Five second penalty for... Yeah, anyone who's got a cat. Sorry, all of your cats are possessed by the devil. Just to let you know. TCS is on. That's a good shout. Anyone know good break bias for this thing? in the seat for extra speed. Down the straights, I need to do down the straights. Oh! Doesn't quite help that you can't see. This thing just dead right is really hard. You have to get on the throttle so early, but then it gets a little bit twitchy if you do it too early. That corner's flat easily. I need to break a little bit later here. Yeah, I could break later than that. my best there. 56.7 is my best. 57.6 just now. Hello Baker. Welcome back to the stream mate. What I would say is that this is nothing like real karting. It just feels nothing like it. 56.9 there. Okay, that's not too bad. What? Good exit. Compared to the last lap, anyway. Come on, go kart. Do good things. Oh, there we go. Six hands up. This is going to be a low 56. If I get this right. Get in yeah, there, boys. Is. Miracles do happen, mate. Thank you, Bonnie. I had a cat that tried jumping out of the car window. See? They're possessed by the devil, mate. Yeah, cats are just weird. My nan is a... Oh. Honestly, what the f*** are we doing here? Would you rather be a bad driver or Pierre Gasly? <laughs> Jesus, that's, that's one of the hardest questions I've ever had. Pierre Gasly or a bad driver? I suppose, hmm, I, I still, uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it's tough. That's really tough. You're going to have to let me sleep on that one. That's too deep. Got the power early. Okay. Yeah, I support Momo's United. They just get red cards every game. Basically, all their players are Sergio Ramos. I think that 56 1 is actually not too bad. That'll put me up a bit higher up than the last time.
Yeah, I was going to say, my nan has had so many cats, because basically... Like, she'll just feed all the cats on the street. And then they end up just always going to her. And then her name is just like... Honestly, it's just your... Just, you just have the cat now, it's your cat. Like, I think that's happened three times. Where she's fed a neighbour's cat. And then the neighbour's just gone... Have it. <laughs> it's yours now. So, yeah, sure. Good old nans. Never let anything go without food, will they? I love nans. Nans are good, aren't they? Yeah. Depends which way you mean that, but... I'll assume you mean the nice way. Oh, mate, let's see where that time puts me. I can't beat that now. How much TC do you use? I was, I was on zero then. Throw naan bread. Naan bread's pretty good, to be fair. Okay, third on my list. What's the top ten? 55.5. Damn, so entire massacre. <sighs> What's my force feedback settings? Um, I always get this question. I, I don't even know. Uh, 10 and 10. 10, force feedback settings, 10, yeah. 10 and 10. On the wheel, um, 100. Try turning ABS off. Have a look. Okay. Um, what do I do? Abs. Where's the abs? Off. Right, let's give it. Let's give it a try. Feels weird. Get used to it though, come on. saying big thank you to all this this crowd i mean you guys have been amazing thank you matt Pryor. would i replace the air with nico i'm assuming hulkenberg um to be honest i wouldn't um i don't know i just think hulkenberg's like very good very reliable but like doesn't have the cutting edge to like win a title so I probably would oh man to be fair this ABS off does feel very good but um Hulkenberg in a, in a Red Bull I, w I wouldn't do it I mean Red Bull wouldn't do it for a start Kvyat, it's got to be Kvyat or Albon first. Um, I wouldn't mind seeing Kvyat get it again. I, I do like Albon though, I wouldn't mind seeing him get it. But at the same time, I wouldn't mind seeing Gasly just get his act together and stop being so shite. I wouldn't mind that either. 
It seems like with this ABS off, you can just turn into the corner a little bit better while on the brakes. It doesn't understeer so much. Two minutes to go right we've got enough time for uh, probably only one more lap no should just have enough time for two it's five i was afraid of one up Yeah, this car is actually very quick around this track. It just handles so well. The straight line speed isn't too bad. To be quicker than a lot of the cars in this game. 7 0. Honestly, what the f are we doing here? Thank you, Jack Hebbing. I am Albon. To be fair, like. I don't, I don't even think it is racism, I do look quite like him. It's like, it's just a fact. I'll start doing that line in the corner, I think. Thank you, Jack Hemming. I look nothing like no honestly from the right angle it's not it's not like I'm not the twin of him. Like, it's not like it's not too dissimilar. From the right angle. The 1080 spin strats. Good strategy that. Confuses your opponent. I don't know what's going on. Okay, fifth play. Oh, got some 55s up there at the front. Look at that. Trevisio's doing a bit of stream sniping tonight. He's in there again. That spiral is a good representation of Brexit. 1080s all over the place. No one knows where they're going. It's all a bit of a mess. Da, da. Pro tip, don't bottle it. Steve, would you consider making me a better racer? I would pay you. Um, Don't bottle it. There you go. You're a better driver now. Uh, can you pay me now, please? At least, at least a thousand pounds for that tip. If not more. Um, You know what? With that kind of question, like... Can you help me? I will pay. It's like completely depends on or how much are you going to pay. Everyone has their price. Can you help me become a better driver for 50p an hour? No. Can you help me become a better driver for 500 pounds an hour? Yeah. Yes, I can. Yeah. I did. Uh, who was it? Um, there was one guy who I've helped on here. He was a follower. He wanted some guidance. We had a one-on-one -on -one tuition. I can't remember how much he paid though. He paid a little bit for it. About three hundred fifty dollars per hour. Ten p an hour. You've got it, mate. Well, can you up it to eleven p, please? 
Only 11 p's my rate. Do I need traction? I don't know. Probably not. I think Eric's gonna hit us. Frederico. Oh, the, the leaders. <laughs> the leaders are spun, and I almost spun following him. Rip. My tip to make you faster is don't spin. Can you pay me now, please? Switching. Oh, he's off. Mods. There's three wide there. Oof. Launch that curb. Get in there. Get in there, Lewis. This, you can just spin out any second in this race. Like you could just die at any moment. Death is very close. I think you need a lift if you're in the slipstream we're going into there. Come on, let's hit the front. That slipstream boy, second place. Oh, we got this, boys. ABS off, yeah. A dibbler, mate. Great tip. I definitely recommend it for this race. Turn the ABS off. You just you can just turn the car a bit better. Oh mate, this is happening. Oh. Now I don't have to slip straight. Down to third again. intense stuff around the outside you got done there mate Ooh, keep it together oh he's almost lost it Oh my god. Last lap. Oh, this is on. Last straight. Come on! Round the outside. Get the cut back. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! Oh, get 
get wrecked. Car master coming through. <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, get dicked on everyone. Get totally dicked on. Get in there, Lewis. Fantastic drive, mate. You are the world champion. Fantastic drive. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, mate, I can't... <laughs> can't believe that. Oh, you just got absolutely dicked on. Everyone. Chat went mental. Chat loved that. Get wrecked. Get absolutely wrecked. Oh man, I can't believe it. I can die happy now, I think. I can die happy. It was good racecraft because, yeah, I was thinking like I could have gone for the move, but I felt like it was best to wait until the end. The back straight is the best place, I think. He covered the inside. The outside move was on. Well, the cut back was on. I'll go again. Yeah, maybe we do. I have to end on a high note, though. Wait. We've got time just to jump back in. Oh, yeah. Here we are. I think Ericsson hit us. Bird.wav. Uh, nice finish, your weapon. Thank you very much, mate. Can we see that finish? Yeah, we got to watch it. Did I save the replay? I hope I did. Felipe, baby, stay cool. We're bringing you the white visor. Stay cool. We're in a good position. Miracles did happen, mate. From Italy. Thank you very much, Federico. Thank you very much, mate. Oh, man. That Dutchman is like... Right now, he's punching himself in the face. He can't believe it. Super GT just came from the last corner out of nowhere. If he had just, it's a hard decision for him because he could have just parked on the apex and I would have gone into the back of him. But he went fully, fully to the outside and it made it an easy choice for me just to go up the inside on the way out. Where did I start? I started fifth. Couldn't erase that. Oh man. I've actually won a race on a live stream. I don't normally ever do that. Didn't even duck on the straight and I still won. I know. I'm so overpowered. If I actually ducked, like, these guys would stand a chance. Thank you, Minute Logic. See you next time, mate. Thank you for jumping in. Oh, there's the lead. we got to see that. Who's that? He won. It did help that the pole sitter binned himself. I must admit, because it might have been a very different story without this. Oh, mate, that's just that is just that's just the worst thing you can do. Bin yourself on that one like that. Michael Schumacher here. Let's go for every little move. Oh, that guy went off. Michael Schumacher. Oh, I've been Michael Schumacher off. Oh, look at the lean. The key lean is getting busted. Busted right out there. And I must say that ABS really helped. It really helped going into the corners. So I dedicate this win to Dibbler. One of the best mods I have. Please tell me this is a daily. Actual vision, hello. It is indeed a daily race, mate. You've got to jump in and give it a go. It's very good fun. Is this the move? Oh, it's actually quite aggressive, you know. I thought to go for it. He left the space. Position. Played it nice and patient. Stalking him to the very end. Did I go for it here? Yeah, I went for it. It was late. It would have been 
probably would have been contacted if I had fully committed. Oh, Cavalier. Good shout. Good shout, mate. Third. How do I get, how do I get this one? But he went a little bit too slow on the outside. Yeah, to get hold up behind the leader. Look at that lean, love it. And here, this is where the slipstream really counts. This is. Oh, I went on the grass here. I was very lucky to not die. Too much. I was almost into the end of that wall. That would have been a big death moment. Right, let's have a look at this last lap then. He's got ABS on. I haven't. He's got it on, on, on. Unless, uh, unless he can't tell from that. But the ABS thing is yellow for me, which it isn't for anyone else. See the Greek guys move on me at the end of that three. Okay, I'll have a look at that in a minute. This is worthy of a video. Yeah, I think it is actually. Here we go then. This is where it happened. He went to the inside. Fair enough. He's within his rights to cover the inside line, and he did. The outside. Goes over to our speed. The cutback is on. Sensational finish. Oh, that guy just got him on the line as well. This guy. Yeah, the Swiss guy came from fourth. Look at this. He's fourth in, into the last corner in fourth. Sells him for chips around the outside. Goes all over the curb. And he just nicks it. Savage move. Beautiful. This is a great guy at the end of lap three on Paul. Let's have a look. That's the extreme. Yeah. Filthy. ABS, um, AB, I, I turned ABS off, so it comes up yellow, I guess. I went down to the third, yeah. Okay, let's go again. What's it? We've got four minutes till the next one. Alrighty. Go one more time. One more time. That was a good race. If I can replicate that, I've done well, I think. Race entry. Go with the black car again. Black being the fastest colour, obviously. <laughs> Whoa. I didn't mean it like that. Okay, I had a look on the internet and this was on it. Whoa! Lace my couch! Are you using a wheel? I'm actually using the ju Just Dance map. You should try using it, it's actually really good. Yeah, that joke doesn't work because, well, I mean, it should work, but because people always have race in their mind, it doesn't work. So if I said, oh, I'm going to pick this red car because red's the quickest colour, just as a joke, because obviously a coloured up can't make something quick. No one bats an eyelid if I say, oh, yeah, red's the quickest colour. But then if I pick a black car, so black, nothing to do with the black race of people, just a colour of a car, go, oh, yeah, black's the fastest colour. Unfortunately, everyone will just get race of a human being in their mind, which actually has nothing to do with the joke. Okay, I had a look on but the internet, and this was on it. Whoa! Unfortunately, that joke doesn't quite work, I suppose. Uh, infinity flow, time to prove from first place. I've got, I've got, if I get this first place again, I am undisputed, undisputed world champion of carts of all time. 
so this this matters this is this actually matters a lot how do you explain go faster stripes then yeah that's a tricky one actually you've got me there mate What's the fastest car for race A? Um, the black one. Oh, my throttle's sticking. Stop it! No, it's definitely the black one. The black one's always the best, mate. If you ever have a choice, just always choose the black car. It doesn't even matter if it's a rubbish car, just the colour. That's, that, that's all that matters. want to start by saying big thank you to all this this crowd i mean you guys have been amazing thank you infinity flow um yeah i was thinking of actually going back on the multiplayer um career mode i don't think i can be bothered if i'm honest but um multiplayer could come back for sure Good banter, isn't it? Always makes a good video. This is it a good lap? Feels like one anyway. Let's have a look. 54, 55. Uh, not too bad. What's TCS on? Oh, it might have been actually. But it's meant to be off. I'm going to turn that off. Career mode gets boring very quickly. Yeah, career mode on F1 is just, I don't know. I feel like if I make videos on it, it's all like, I don't know what the right word is, but you have to kind of fabricate it. It doesn't feel like you're just playing it for the fun and then all the results are as they should be. It just. I don't know. Just uh, it just feels weird to play it and and then make videos on it. Do you think racing versus AI in Sims is becoming outdated because of online multiplayer? Maybe a little bit, yeah. Um, I say definitely. Think about 20 years ago, you probably would never race against it, uh, someone online. But now, a lot of games focus more online these days. And AI. I mean, this game didn't even have AI at the start. But it did have online. It's the main focus of the game. But, I don't know, maybe AI can make a bit of a comeback when if it gets really good. If, if, it, if AI is good then I don't suppose it's such a bad thing, but a lot of the time it's not good. Could streaming it be better? Maybe, yeah. Uh, F1 that is, but I don't know. I just... It's hard to play so many different games, like... I just got into iRacing as well, and it's like, oh... Have to jump between so many different games is pretty, pretty tricky. Right, here we go. Let's go again. Oh, 
Oh, the leader with a poor start. Oh, I'm mugged around the outside there. Fourth, we're where we started. But the Dutchman, he's back, Commander. Stay in the race. Then the slipstream, you've always got a chance. Oh, TCS, sorry. Yep. Okay, we're good. Oh, they're three abreast. The Spaniards off. Two for the price of one. The Spaniard, two races in a row. Oh, that's a big lunge. Oh, Jesus Christ. Too big of a lunge. In the slipstream, About four temps behind. Let's, have, let's see how much I gain here. Three temps behind. Two temps behind. I gained like two temps on that straight alone. And I lifted there. I shouldn't have lifted. Oh, mistake! I'm into the lead. Just to let him go through, then go side by side. I was trying to give him space, I was looking at the radar. Let's get third back at least. Oh, he's lagging everywhere. Behind there. How's the Spaniard got back up here? Oh, third. Just. That Spaniard made a good recovery. 
Oh, one stupid mistake. Could have been a win. Should have been second at least. Oh well. We'll go back to the podium. Oh. A first and a third in the go karts. I would love to drive one of these shifter carts. Get in there, Lewis. Miracles do happen, mate. Infinity flow. Good bottle job, mate. Yeah. Got it all wrong. It's annoying because, like, he was on the outside. I was just trying to see exactly where it was and leave him space, and I just looked at the radar. Yeah. Made the mistake. Oh, well. Things happen, don't they? Things happen. Unlucky. Right. Excuses. Not really. Things happen. It was a mistake. I owned up to my mistake. It's not an excuse. It's a mi I owned up to my mistake. Um. That's it for today. Quest Pino. I haven't played it quite as much recently. Right. Thank you so much, everyone, for tuning in. Much love, as always. Hope you've enjoyed the stream. I've enjoyed those races. Well, the, the last couple of races. The second half of the stream. First half was a bit tricky, but we improved. We got there in the end. But that's it for today. Thank you so much, everyone. Much love as always. Um, yeah. Take care. And don't get sent to the Shadow Realm. I'll see you next time. Have a nice day. Have a nice night. Have a nice life. Next time. Wow.